Her Majesty was delighted after receiving a touching knitted Sandringham estate which is now on display at the Royal Residence until October. The intricate display was created by Margaret Seaman, a 92-year-old great-great-grandmother. Ms. Seaman had spent two years working on the Royal Residence and from the start of the pandemic knitted up to 15 hours a day. The 92-year-old revealed the Queen had enjoyed the knitted Sandringham which is now on display at the estate. She said, that was absolutely wonderful, she seemed to enjoy it very much. I started it two years ago and knitted the main house the first year and then the second year while we were in lockdown I did the remaining buildings the church and the stables and the museum. Although we were in lockdown I was never bored, or never wished I could go out or anything, I was quite happy at home knitting Sandringham. I thoroughly enjoyed it. I live with my daughter since I lost my husband and I knit all day. She does everything else and looks after me and does all the cooking. And I knit between 12 and 15 hours a day. Ms. Seaman began the project in order to raise money for local hospices and charities. She has also set up a Just Giving page for three hospitals. Norwich University Hospital a maternity bereavement suite at the Queen Elizabeth Hospital, Kings Lynn and a community improvement project at the James Paget University Hospital, Galston-on-Sea. As well as being a knitted version of the Royal Residence, the piece also includes miniatures of members of the Royal Family. It is also 18 feet long which includes landmarks of the property such as St. Mary Magdalene Church. The knitted marvel will able to be viewed at Sandringham House until October 14th.